Welcome to Bluffton High, the best school in town. Come on, let's take a look around. I think the best thing about Bluffton High is you're going to get so many sides of the spectrum. Um, it's a big melting pot. We have a super, super diverse background of students, and we have some students that are super, super high achieving that will be doing a lot of clubs and doing a lot of good sports. And then we also have some students who will be focusing on what's going on in the classroom, but they also do a lot of good stuff with their family outside of school. So the best thing about Bluffton High School is whatever you want to happen in your life, you can make happen in Bluffton. You can come here and get a really good hands-on experience, great teachers, a great student body. And then from there, um, we just try to set you up and build a strong foundation to help you get to whatever it is you want to do after school. Something I enjoy the most about Bluffton High is just the support system that we have here. There are so many great um, teachers, administration, students, everyone's really looking out for you and there's so many different opportunities to get involved. I have been a part of a lot of the clubs here. I've been in student council, NHS, um, environmental club, um, youth and government, lots of them in sports. And it's really just great to see how all of the different people, the teachers, your um, teammates, coaches, everyone, they just really want the best for you and want to help you out. Um, it's been great to meet so many of the people that I've met here. The AP Capstone program is basically a program that allows high school students to get a bit of a taste of college classes, get a bit of a head of their current grade and their current classes. Students that want to look into the AP Capstone program should definitely give it a try in their freshman year with typically starting with AP Human Geographies. I enjoy the different types of classes we have as well as the staff members. I feel like they do a good job of helping us out. I'm in AP Chemistry. So right now we are in lab testing the absorbance of crystal violet and we're gonna use that to see the kinetics with um, the breakdown of O2 with um, Crystal Violet. Um, I think it's a really good school. We've got lots of options for AP classes. I have been in the JRTC program for four years now. One thing I enjoy about JRTC is the way it improves my leadership attributes that are further gonna improve my military career. Not only does it improve you mentally and physically, but it challenges you. Uh, the reason why I like ROTC is because it really teaches me how to improve my physical fitness. A reason why you should join ROTC is because it improves your discipline and teaches you how to become a better citizen. Bluffton makes sure everyone is welcome and feels at home. I think it's important to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month because I think people need to be educated on all the cultures and not just Hispanics but all types of races. I feel like when I saw, when I arrived into a school and I see the interest, I see the flags for, for, all the Latin, for all the Latin countries, I see the music, so I feel like I'm home, like okay, if for one month the American adapts to my culture. Bluffton offers a variety of athletics that keeps you busy. We offer a lot of sports uh, throughout the year here at Bluffton High School. Uh, in the fall season, we offer swimming, and girls golf, girls tennis, football, cheerleading, cross country, and volleyball. Uh, moving into the winter, we offer girls and boys basketball, wrestling, and cheerleading. And in the spring, we offer boys tennis and golf, softball, baseball, track and field, boys and girls lacrosse, and boys and girls soccer. It's really great. It's a great team here and coaches. It's really fun getting out and playing in the great weather we have down here. I think it'd be a great opportunity for you guys to get out there and meet a bunch of people and stay exercising and just have a lot of fun with high school. I recommend cross country because it's a good sport to like meet new people because we have a really big team. And like if you're just starting out in high school next year, then you really get to like meet a lot of new people and don't go into high school without knowing anyone. Uh, I play football, I play defensive end, and why do I play football is inspire other people to go and play football and 
inspired your dream? I play volleyball and lacrosse. I've played two years on varsity with Coach Tina. It's been a really great experience. I've learned so much about the sport and I've really enjoyed all of it. I started playing lacrosse freshman year. That was my first time ever playing, but I really enjoyed being on the team and I learned so much from my coach. Um, just learning a whole new game that I had never played before. The art program is another great option for students. I have to say, Miss Peugeot's drawing one class was the first class I took, and I think that was the most memorable and my favorite because it really taught me the like the starting point of pencil drawings and different graphites and different pastels and everything. Ceramics, uh, we work with clay, and you can be really creative and you can make different things, but you can make even foods, uh, animals, you can make any kind of things. My favorite part about the class is stone in the wheel. It's like this circle wheel, and it can go pretty fast, and it's really symmetrical. Bluffton High also has a good music program. I'm currently taking piano, and you know, it's just such a fun class to take and learn how to play a new instrument, which is such a creative and empowering feeling. I've taken four years of orchestra. Uh, every year I've been with Ms. Irwin. Uh, it's really fun. Uh, when I first joined, I didn't feel like I could fit in, but I got to meet everybody. Ms. Ernan made me feel really comfortable there, and it was overall just really fun, and I got to learn how to play music. Everyone at Bluffton takes pride in their school spirit. School spirit is very important um, because we have a lot of students that are involved in athletics as well as other extracurricular activities, and um, for us to have spirit for all those things, um, to show support for our fellow students, but also um, just show su support for our school um, and in our community, and just to put the Bobcat name out there, you know, we're always saying it's better to be a Bobcat. Well, I think school spirit, with showing our school spirit, we're, we're proving that, and uh, we're showing everybody that we are proud to be a Bobcat, um, and we're proud of each other here within the building. You feel more of a family, you feel involved with the school, and you know, it's just, it's just very, very important, I think, to the overall atmosphere at a school. I think school spirit is important because y'all should get excited about, about where you go to school. Um, you should get excited about your community and more importantly than anything, it's, it's really cool to be a part of something bigger than yourself. Um, the athletics and the, the clubs and those things go on well after homecoming week is over. So I do think it's important to keep supporting each other um, and keep cheering for each other um, and just be uh, supporters of our, our friends and our fellow teachers and, and all of that just to uh, have spirit every single day. When we're playing a game in the, in the gym and the gym is packed out and the t uh, crowd is loud and uh, uh, semi-obnoxious, it just adds so much to the overall uh, Esprit de corps, you know, which is just a good feeling, good camaraderie of the, of the entire student population and as well as the faculty. I feel like homecoming week, yeah, we really come out and the students come strong with spirit and that's awesome to see, but this school's worth being proud of more than just one week a year. So I feel like that's something that you guys need to come out and try to do each and every day so that the people outside of these walls want to see what's going on inside of these walls because there's a lot of good stuff. The biggest advice that we would give all ninth graders and rising freshmen is you just want to be as active as possible. I'd say like the best advice I could possibly give you is to always stay on top of your work. I would definitely tell upcoming freshmen to get involved. I know it's a little bit hard. I was a shy freshman when I got here and but when you talk to people, try and make friends, join clubs, play sports, talk to your teachers. Talking to your teachers is a big one that um, a lot of people, you know, they get in class, get out of class, try not to interact with them, but um, a lot of the teachers here are so great and just talking to them is really gonna help you out. Um, just, yeah, try and get into stuff, be involved. It's really gonna make your high school experience extra special.